Welcome back to Biafra News Support Biafra at Biafra here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you. Depending on where you're watching me from, Biafra's lovers of freedom, people of goodwill, I bring you another news and update. We all can remember that Biafra Republic Government in Elza, Prime, Prime Minister Mazi Simone, has warned Zoo repentant Boko Rams in the army to dismantle their checkpoint and roadblocks in Biafra land and stop extorting from our people. And also, Biafra Prime Minister gave them ultimatum. And they still don't want to leave Biafra land. They keep extorting out from our people. In the north, they believe, Fulanese and the Alsas believe that the north belongs to them. And nobody can come to their land and do as, they, as he or she pleases and go scot-free. All right? I don't know why these people think that they can come to south is mount checkpo uh, checkpoint and the roadblocks from pillar to pole extorting from our people and nobody will say anything. Not that they, they are doing only that in Biafra land. They are doing a whole lot of things in Biafra land. All right. So this very news, I'm getting it from Biafra Liberation page. And I will also read a headline of the news of people or how many people that have been killed by Fulani terrorists in Nigeria. All right. So first, update 13 in Obolafo, 12 in Agulu, 14 in Osumni, Osumeni. So many. I don't even know if that's correct if I'm pronouncing it well. 17 in Mando, 17 in Nkwale, 23 in Obo, 22 in Ohafia. Before we continue, I would like to welcome all the new and old subscribers. If you're coming across my channel for the first time, kindly click the red subscribe button, turn on the notification bell to enable you get notification once I upload a new video. And please tune in once you get notification. Please subscribe share like leave your comment at the comment section so we must continue five in here seven in nanka two in amavia 62 in imo state imo state where hope was already my promise the full needs oh imo state is your state now you can come and do as you please nobody will say anything troop in as they troop in they started receiving water water because they never they never expected it they thought oh pose are my own imo state and they, they can take imo state as they and, and do as they please you know it doesn't work like that that means you can you can be easily deceived so 62 in imo state <laughs> nine in oka eight in over 15 in enugu ezike 16 in opuno all politicians one or key way we are a five in aba uh, 19 in a boy all right biafra land must be cleaned those one nigeria enable us in biafra land what the water you people you people haven't seen anything one idiot called Biafra Child was rejecting, was rejoicing yesterday on his platform that Biafra Liberation Army camp and most of our gallant men were wide. It was very, it was a very hard day for me until I saw your post today. Great job, our fearless gallant men. May Chukukika Biama continue to keep you all safe. Okay, this comment is coming from Olo Obona. So some Galibo Biafrans don't normally believe all this news. And do you know what I like about Biafran Prime Minister whenever he make posts concerning Biafran Liberation Army and Nigeria Army? Because we're not hiding anything, all right? If Nigeria Army is doing the right thing, they will not be hiding. They will not, they will not you know, be hiding and be running from the truth, okay? Biafran Prime Minister always tag them. He always tag them whenever they come to kill Biafrans and, they, and they, the tables get turned. Or the table get turned, all right? They always hide it. But once they kill innocent people in Biafra land, uh, Biafra land and tag them ESN, they, to the extent these people were carrying pipes saying they, they busted ESN camp. I was like, where is the camp in the picture I'm seeing? Is it the, is it the pipe? I don't really understand. So Biafra Prime Minister always tag them for them to come and debunk it if it's not true and then knowing very well that they are committing genocide in biafra land they are they are, they are committing crime in biafra land they are not supposed to be in biafra land in the first place that is why they always keep quiet all right i know some of you don't believe it some of you will say it's photoshop some of you nigerian army knows what they're doing in biafra land and they knows that the whole world will be against them that is why they always hide Whenever be a friend, prime minister tags them. Even if it's not written in English, even people that don't speak English, once it's been published in their language and they get to read the headline, they will know that Nigerian army 
are not supposed to be in Biafra land. Bombarding Biafrans, burning down our houses, destroying our properties, our means of livelihood. The question will be, what are you doing in Southeast? Why are you bombarding the land and the people? Is there any work going on there? And they will tell you no. So why the bombardment? Why are you bombing the people in Southeast? There is no work going on. Since they are looking for war, why not they go to Niger? Let them go and see what they are looking for. They will not go to Niger. They believe that Southeast is where they can come and do as they please. But <laughs> to them, they have failed to realize that it's before, not now anymore. Once they come, they receive water, water. Dismantle your checkpoint, dismantle your roadblocks. Biafra land is no longer that land you come and distort and go scot-free. Not that you are in the land to protect the people. You are not in the land to protect the people. Rather, you are there to terrorize them, to destroy their property, to destroy their means of livelihood, and distort money from them. You are not doing those things with, uh, with uh, respect and, and uh, uh, regard, knowing that people, these people are humans. They always do us like, oh, we, we are nobody and we can treat you people the way, you the way we like. You will see our people raising their hands up while, they, while passing checkpoints. I've seen a lot of videos of our people raising their hands up, passing Fulani Repentant Boko Haram's army checkpoints in Biafra land. And our people keep lamenting, asking, when will all this intimidation end? When will all these humiliations end? When will all these atrocities and all this see finish end? The time has come. And it gets me angry and it pisses me off when I see some gullible fools that claim to be from Southeast. Or that claim to, oh, we are Igbos. My mother told me that I'm an Igbo. Keep ranting how you don't have to go after security men. How you don't have to attack them. How you don't have to fight back. Okay, they are free to bomb Biafra land with their fighter jet. They are free to bombard Biafra land. They are free to kill our people. They are free to mount checkpoints from pillar to pole in Biafra land, starting from Biafrans. They are free to mount roadblocks in Biafra land, starting from our people. They are free to tell our people to raise their hands up whenever they are passing their checkpoints. Even if you are in a vehicle, you have in the bus, you have to come down, raise your hand up and pass their checkpoint. As what exactly? No, we no longer have freedom in our own land. We no longer have freedom of movement in our own land. And some eflefus, you see some eflefus defending these repentant Boko Rams in the army, telling you, oh, you have to obey the army. And that, that was when I realized that there are some eflefus that have, that have baptized yourself and they have resided to remain enslaved. They have baptized themselves with uh, poverty. Oh, we want to continue being impoverished. They have, baptized, they have decided that they want to remain enslaved forever, but not us. You can't be among us and be dragging us back. I am the deepest pit of one Nigeria, even had The the deepest side the zoo is resting in the ocean. I buy a You can't you can't block our way. Yeah, you have what am I even saying? We are moving train. Oh go on, It's not up to us anymore. If you block our way, I say we speed. I Enough is enough. They can't continue. Now, let me read this for you. Let me read this, this particular one for you. If it's Be a Friend Liberation Army that posted it, some people will start ranting. All right? If it's the Be a Friend Liberation Army that posted this figure, some Efule fools will be fast to comment saying it's, it's too much. But when Zoo Media post something, the Be a Friend Liberation Army post, they will help the Zoo Media. All the same, we are finishing the Zoo on daily basis. There are... Uh, Generals has their generals has been crying out saints for help. You see them making some comments sometimes. It's just that they don't know how to come out openly. They will not tell you what they are doing in Southeast because they are not doing anything there. They can't tell you. Oh, this is the exact thing we're doing in South. They are doing nothing there, and that is why the more they receive water, water, the more they go and hide and cry in shame. All right, and they will keep receiving water. water. Now let me read this for you. 50,000 Christians killed in Nigeria by Islamist uh, uh, extremists. Okay. Are you hearing it? This is from uh, Vatican News. Hmm? 50,000 Christians killed by Fulani terrorist bandit. 
and if we tell you that they are repentant Boko Haram, they are reintegrating into the army, deploying to southeast, are being dealt with. Some of you will be ranting up and down. Biafran Liberation Army is telling you how many of these terrorists they have, you know, visited. Dismantle your checkpoint and roadblock. Leave Biafra land. Biafra land belongs to us. If you people want to mount checkpoint, go to the north. Leave Biafra land alone. What they can do in the north, they are doing it in the southeast because they believe they can do as they please in the south southeast. And as they are coming to do it, they, they are meeting their fellow men. Our gallant men are <laughs> welcoming them. Oh, welcome our guys. What exactly are you people looking for? They will not be able to tell you. Immediately they hear, what are you people looking for? They will, took, they will flee. You will see them at the, the other side of the road asking you, where is the gunshot coming from? You people don't know what is going on in Biafra land. They brought war to our doorsteps and we can't fold our hands and watch them. Do you know what it means? Seeing your own people raising their hands up while passing strangers, invaders, checkpoints in our own land. Our people will leave their houses very early in the morning to go cut up for their families. And while coming back, these people will extort from them and still keep them on the road. Telling them to raise their hands up. You will see traffic. You will be asking yourself, what is going on? And if they finally allow them to pass, they will ask them to come down from the, the from bus and raise their hands up. Is that okay? No, is it proper? Some of you supporting these people, supporting one Nigeria with all these atrocities. Look at what is going on in your zoo. And you people, that is the exact thing you people want us to continue enduring to relate it. After we have endured for 100, 100 years for the amalgamation to expire, we have endured for more, almost a decade again. They still don't want to let go. You people want us to continue suffering and smiling. You people want us to, just all our lives to depend on enduring. Endure, oh, we'll keep enduring forever. No, it's not us. We know who we are. As they have failed to dismantle their checkpoint, our uh, gallant men, be a friendly Russian army, will keep visiting them. And they shouldn't run. No. They should wait and take that thing they are looking for. Their friendly Russian army has helped them find it. And they will keep delivering it to their checkpoint, one by one. The problem is that they always run. Whenever they, they, they are, their order arrives, they always run, abandoning their vehicles and their, and their checkpoint. And I don't know why they are running. That is the problem. I always ask myself, before you mount this checkpoint, don't you know that you ordered for something? And know that the, or the, the order must arrive. That is what I always ask myself. Is there something else? You expect that thing to come. And when that thing is uh, it, it's about to be delivered to you, you start running. They don't only extort from our people, they kill, they bomb our people's houses, they destroy. These people you are extorting from, you demolish their, their uncle, uncompleted buildings with your armor tank. That is our anger. You come to our land to extort us. You not only extort, you kill our people, you destroy our people's properties. You destroy their means of livelihood, the same place they make the money you people extort from them. After destroying their means of livelihood, where else do you people expect our people to get money that you people will extort? If they refuse to give you people, the next thing is to kill them. <laughs> All this can continue in Biafra. It can't continue in Biafra land. No, enough is enough. These people will demolish our people's houses with their uncompleted or with their armor tank, uncompleted building, with their armor tank. And you still see their checkpoint roadblocks from pillar to pole in South. Is that not wickedness? That is you hating people with hitting, hating people for no reason, with passion. You destroy their means of livelihood. You destroy their property. You destroy their houses. You destroy everything. And you still want checkpoints to start from them. We can't continue folding our hands and watch them. That is why our gallant men are doing what they're doing, flushing them out of Biafra land, because they hate us with passion. They don't want us to live. They don't know what live, let's live is. You think they don't know what they did when they told you, oh, we have uh, integrated repentant Boko Haram's into the army. It's because they're those they're, they're telling you they're rehabilitated, has finished them in Savisa Forest. And they need more bloodthirsty uh, 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 Boko Haram's they will send to Southeast. Those things you're seeing with uniform and the AK-47, you think they're soldiers. They are all terrorists, repentant Boko Haram's.
That is why they can't come to Biafra land to mount checkpoint and roadblocks from pillar to pole extorted from our people. That is why they will not be allowed into Biafra land. They will be flushed out. They are not only coming to extort from our people, they are coming to kill, terrorize, humiliate, intimidate, marginalize, destroy properties, means of livelihood of Biafrans. That is why our gallant men are doing what they are doing. And if you're not happy about that, got your food transformer. I saw one transformer now. Now, where is this gunshot coming from? God, they are giving care of barbecue. They are rebellion. So, that is it, dear friends. I will stop here. Biafra Liberation Army visited many zoo checkpoints and roadblocks in Biafra land and uh, give them water, water, send many of them to a judgment and the journey of no return. That is their business. They got what they were looking for. Biafra land can continue being terrorized by these criminals in uniform or repentant Boko Haram they are deploying into Biafra land. It can continue. More strength to our gallant men and genuine Biafra supporting our gallant men and the Biafra restoration. If they want to do as they please, let them go to the north, not in our land. Our people have cried enough of the checkpoints everywhere in Biafra land. Before you get to your destination, you know how many thousands you, you will spend on the road. Not the transport alone. The transport is very expensive. But you'll still be spending money in giving those that are supposed to face government for higher payment. They keep extorting from our people. Not that they are in our land to do what they are supposed to do. Rather, they are there to terrorize because they hate Igbos. They hate Igbos with passion. And they are being told, go to South East, do as you please. And they're flayful there. say, hey, yes, they nodded their head like Agama Lizard. Oh, you're free to come to South East and do as you please. Or do as you please to the IPOB, indigenous people of Biafra. And then before coming, they rushed to South East. Before coming, they didn't bother to ask question. Hajurese. Hajurese, Kahamara, to indigenous people of Biafra, Galantime, and Ishikwadom. The more they come, the more they receive water, water. The more they fall. That is it, dear friends. Don't forget to share, like, leave your comment at the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on your notification bell on. Don't forget to share in all the social media platforms. All I ask is your support while I bring you update of all the happenings in Biafra and that everything that has to do with Biafra restoration. The reason you need to keep watching Biafra news support Biafra. Thank you all. I still remain Ada Biafra.